Hi. So when you are recording MIDI, the MIDI data is triggered at the beginning of each note. If I start playing the song at the beginning of the note, it's triggered and I hear it like this. But if I move the playhead to the middle of the note, I won't hear anything like this. Okay, so I think this is the default in Logic. If you have long notes, like say a pad, like this song has, you have to keep going back to the beginning just so that the pad is triggered and playing when the rest of the instruments come in. So the solution is to go to File, Project Settings, and MIDI. And from here, click on the Chase tab and then click on the checkbox for notes. Now, this will trigger the note wherever you start playing. So I'll just start right here like it did before. And voila, it's playing. Cool. Okay, but one thing to be mindful of is that the MIDI note will be triggered as if it's at the beginning. And here's what I mean. Listen to the beginning of this note and notice the way the instrument comes in and then decays. I'll go ahead and solo it. So here's the way it comes in and then decays. So a swell and then it, it decays. But when I move the playhead forward, yes, the note will be triggered but it will be triggered as if it's at the beginning of the note, not in the middle of the note where it has decayed. So I'm just going to leave it where it is, press play again, and you'll hear it sound like it's at the very beginning of the note. So that's what I mean there. But if you know the solution to this, please let me know. But in any case, just being able to listen to the MIDI notes at the playhead rather than having to start at the beginning each time is super helpful with my songwriting, and I hope it is for you also. Thanks for watching.